On Wednesday, the 26th of June, ground was broken for the development of the Morant Bay Urban Center on the grounds of the old Goodyear factory. And while this was a most significant day for the future of St. Thomas, I cannot help but to reflect on the absolute waste that the Goodyear factory has been since it was closed down some 22 years ago. Approximately 3,000 jobs are to become available to the people of St. Thomas through the development of the Morant Bay Urban Center on the site of the old Goodyear factory at a cost of 4 billion Jamaican dollars. These are much needed jobs and an injection of investment into the nation's forgotten parish. The site for this new development has opened old wounds, well, for me anyways as I cannot help but to think of the opportunities residents of the parish might have lost due to the lack of vision from the political directorate past and present. The Goodyear factory employed more than 200 people until its abrupt closure in 1997 and since then many elected officials have used the factory to create a false sense of hope among St. Thomas residents as promise after promise have been followed up by the inevitable disappointments. Case in point, there have been plans to convert the old space into a technology park as part of the production train. But surprise, surprise, this never got off the ground. Sometime after the factory was closed down, a new building was constructed on the site to establish an IT facility. However, that building has remained largely unused since its construction. Yes, a building that was renovated at a cost of 250 million Jamaican dollars leading up to the 2002 general elections. In 2005, Commerce, Science and Technology Minister Philip Paulwell announced that they had plans to establish a call center facility where hundreds of residents of the parish would be employed after they were trained. No prize for guessing that this too never materialized. In 2014, Minister of Industry, Investment and Commerce Anthony Hilton had announced plans to construct a film lot in Jamaica. He informed that negotiations were far advanced for the lease of the 20-acre former Goodyear factory and complex as the site for the film lot. A Hollywood studio has agreed to provide oversight on the project, the minister said, adding that the group Real Vibes was also in discussion with a leading music and film production school in the United States of America to build a campus at the location. Again, that never saw the light of day. Now, despite the recent groundbreaking ceremony, it would be no surprise if many residents still harbor doubts that this proposed development will become a reality. And who could blame them? Because, as my grandmother used to say, once bitten, twice shy. And yes, I know, some persons will ask, but teach, why are you doing this video now, when things are about to happen? And my response to that is, irrespective of the plans in place and the appearance that there may finally be some follow through, the simple fact is that the factory building has been a ripe old waste. A waste of time, a waste of space, a waste of money and most notably and regrettably a waste of opportunities. So yes, the factory was closed as many factories usually are, but it should not have remained closed for so long. It should not have been allowed to fall in such a state of disrepair. It could have and should have been repurposed and with just a little vision, that space could have been made 
to provide jobs to sustain many families across the parish of St. Thomas. Despite the 22 years of neglect, lack of vision and many broken promises, 2019 appears to be a good year for this empty shell, but only time will tell if this latest proposal with groundbreaking and all will remain a pipe dream or become a reality. Teach them! Hey yo, hello! Send the message and make it reach them. It's teach them right here. Warlord representing. Thank you for watching. Please leave a comment below. Remember to like and share the video. Don't forget to subscribe for more awesome content. Follow me on social media and check out the suggested videos on screen. This is Teach saying until next time. Walk good, my friends.